the Louisville Ballet is putting the classical music on pause for one of the new projects, and they're getting help from one of hip hop's biggest stars and a Louisville resident. WDRB's Joel Skipper has your first look inside rehearsals for 502. These guys here at the Louisville Ballet are used to focusing on classical music, like Romeo and Juliet or the Nutcracker, but for the next few months, they're focusing on the music of Jack Harlow. It's a different pace and a different tone for dozens of company members of the Louisville Ballet. Tuesday, we got an early sneak peek at a new production called 502, which features the music of Louisville rapper Jack Harlow. It's fun for us to not be as kind of on top and pretty and get a little bit more grounded and still bring our technique to the picture, but also um, have a little bit of flair for Jack. According to Dance USA, 27% of ballet patrons have not been back since the pandemic. The Louisville Ballet was struggling to make ends meet and decided to change things up for a few shows. Ballet companies around the world are really focused on how we can engage new patrons and audiences and certainly a younger audience to grow into the future to support Louisville Ballet. The Jack Harlow Foundation has donated $50,000 to the Louisville Ballet to help meet fundraising goals. And then there's something in the arms here. Choreographer Ching Ching Wong was brought in from Montreal for the 502 project that's still in its initial stages. One, it's something that I can't be denied. And two, the creative forces that start bubbling in me is, is astronomical. Most of the company has some background in modern dance, but never together in a ballet setting. Yes, the famous toe shoes will be there, but so will the desire to reach a younger audience. When a certain piece of classical music come on, we all start bopping along, but definitely when Jack's music comes on, you look around the room and everybody's just kind of grooving on the side before they start doing their choreography, so it's a fun time. I think the energy is what's going to really um, stand out to everybody, and I think you're going to see the company in a whole different light that you've never seen them in before. And you can check out the Louisville Ballet when they perform 502 at the Brown Theater November 1st through the 3rd. Reporting in Louisville with photojournalist Neil Johnson, I'm Joel Skipper, WDRV News.